Hello and welcome to another video of Circuit Digest. Today we are going to make a filament sensor that will sense where the filament is broken down or filament run out or not. You can see over here, traditional sensors have limit switches basis sensor whose uh, working is like simple. When whenever the filament is present, then it will uh, it will be pressed like this, and whenever the filament is broken or to, uh, breaking from here, then it will goes like this. So this this are these sensors are mostly working where the their thermal runover uh, filament runover are there. If the filament is broken from output side, you can see here the filament stand sensor fails to sense that the fil filament is broken from there. Okay, so to overcome these problems, we have made a smart filament sensor who will work upon moving uh, of the filament basis. Here you can see the filament is going from here to here uh, using these pipes and whenever the filament moves, it rotates this wheel. Here you can see <coughs> if you move like this, the, the rotor is moving. Okay, so there is an optical encoder sensor uh, situated here that will goes uh, that will send the signal to this ATT knee. Okay, and it will take the signal as a reference and then calculate how uh, how much time is it is being active. If the activity time is greater than 20 seconds, then it will beep. This 20 seconds or 25 seconds or 20 uh, seconds are being uh, then that can that can be customized using this potentiometer and whole sensor can be enabled and disabled using this thing this button on off so here you can see 8080 85 i am putting it like this okay so now i am enabling it here you can see there is an air, uh, red led light glowing here you can see <coughs> whenever the wheel is moving then the uh, light blinks so this will this uh, will continuously blink to get the signal that the filament is moving properly okay so now let's test it firstly disable it and then put something on print so here you can see the printer start started working now here you can see the filament sensor starts moving now enable it and So now you can see the blinking goes turned on. So as soon as this filament is moving through of this uh, sensor, the wheel moves and then it detects the movement of filament. If the filament doesn't move for <coughs> 20, I have uh, tuned it to 20 seconds. You can do it according to your printer speed. So I have uh, made it 20 seconds to blink. So if the 20, if the filament doesn't move for 20 seconds, then it will buzz. I will show you the demonstration. See if if I cut the filament from here. So now, as you can see, the filament also may break from this side. So let's see what happens. Just remind that uh, I have given it for 20 seconds, so it, it must be about 20 seconds. So here you can see the beeping sound. 